The ordinary council meeting, chaired by Ochiwarongo Mayor Gottlieb Shibute, dealt with affairs of the town council when the gathering was disrupted by placard carrying community members. However, Landless People's Movement councillor Sebedius Kwitab objected, saying the plot in question was not part of the agenda, therefore cannot be discussed. The point of a deputation that was attached, it indicates here on the agenda that Can nothing, again, I, I cannot hear you. The interview and deputation that has been submitted here. Objection, Chair. There's an objection here. Proceed because uh, you but want to. But I never said anything. I stand up, I put up my hand to say something, then there's, there's objection now. How? I never said anything. Honorable Councillor, please oh, let's follow procedures. I know you, you are seeking attention. No, oh, I'm not objecting him. And I did not even submit. It's an objection. You give me a chance to talk. I'm objecting on the placards that I'm seeing. We just have given an information that this is an arcade town. I do not know what are these placards for. We were not informed of any uh, demonstration. We were not informed of any gatherings. I do not know what are they for. So what I'm trying to ask is that can we maybe just first address these people that are having a placard yes. before we can continue with the meeting could not proceed as planned, and the mayor ordered the people to be removed from the council chambers. The dispute over the plot is believed to date back more than 10 years. It was leased to a resident who breached the leasehold agreement with the municipality by selling it to another person who failed to develop the plot. This delay resulted in the current occupant, Briggs Kachitai, illegally occupying the plot for eight years. The council is now in the process of evicting Kachitai because there are four other people claiming ownership of the plot. Mayor Gottlieb Shivute then postponed the debate on the matter to allow time for an investigation into the matter. Faith Sankwasa, NBC News, Oshiwarongo.